The internet is dead. Since then, everything you see online is fake. Every comment, every blog post, completely artificially generated. You may be real, but everything you're seeing online is all made by fake bot accounts. Sometimes it's obvious, but sometimes accounts with blue check marks that you think are real are really just better at hiding. Even videos can't be trusted anymore. Since the spread of deepfake technology, AI-generated videos are seen everywhere. So what happened here? Could it be that the real internet died, or more specifically, was killed years ago? So a new artificial one could be made, a fake internet used to manipulate and control all of us. Well, that's what the dead internet theory suggests. The dead internet theory is an online conspiracy theory. It emerged at some point in the late 2010s or early 2020s, we're not sure exactly when, and like many online conspiracy theories, it emerged out of forums like 4chan and 8chan. While the main ideas of the dead internet theory were floating around from forum to forum, one thread in 2021 brought this theory from the hidden corners of the web to the outside world and gave it its name. On a forum called Agora Road's Macintosh Cafe, which apparently is the best kept secret of the internet, a user by the name of Illuminati Pirate, very conspiracy sounding name, wrote a thread called Dead Internet Theory. Most of the internet is fake. In their post, Illuminati talks about a lot. And we're going to go through all of it. Just kidding, no one's got that kind of time. After a quick biography of who they are and some references to forum ideas like Raptor Jesus who went extinct for our sins, most of what Illuminati Pirate talks about is what they see as the state of the internet today. Or really that the internet doesn't even exist anymore and hasn't since 2016. It was at that time that Illuminati Pirate was chatting with someone online on some forum and started getting an uncanny feeling that the way that person was talking was off. And that's when everything clicked for Illuminati Pirate. Everything from movies and music to politicians and the news, all made by AI. And all this artificial content is not the result of some algorithm going bad. It's a deliberate murder of the internet by some group of people. And Illuminati Pirate shows us what they see as proof, connecting all the pieces to come to the main conclusion of their post that the US government is engaging in an artificial intelligence powered gaslighting of the entire world population. Yeah. So that's what Illuminati Pirate was saying. And I know it sounds unbelievable and very fringe. And in the beginning of this theory spreading across the internet, for most people, it remained an unbelievable fringe theory. But in the last year or so, everything changed. New presidential order on artificial intelligence. The future is already upon us. Artificial intelligence is becoming more prevalent in our every... Artificial intelligence, or AI, is everywhere. It's now part of our conversations about education, politics, social media. It's also become a hot topic in the art world. International Monetary Fund has warned that 40% of all jobs around the world will be impacted by AI. Because of AI, the dead internet theory has become a lot more believable. And some argue the dead internet theory is now the dead internet reality. Since ChatGPT is being used everywhere, from blog articles, to newsrooms, to social media posts, and even script writing in movies, it seems like humans are writing less and less original content. Not to mention the use of deep fakes for actors in Hollywood, or to create artificial influencers and models. And if you feel like AI is kind of everywhere, you're not wrong. Experts estimate that 90% of online content will be artificially generated by 2026. That's in two years, by the way. So was Illuminati Pirate right? Well, they said a lot of incorrect and politically biased stuff in their post. And the internet definitely didn't die in 2016. But by 2026, most of the internet will be artificially generated. In a couple years, we're going to be surrounded by artificially generated content. From bot accounts commenting, from deepfake videos, from ChatGPT writing scripts like this. So in that aspect of the theory, Illuminati Pirate was right, but I definitely don't think the internet is dying. I think it's changing. The fact that most of the internet will be artificial in a couple years, to me just means we have to change the way we look at the internet. In the beginning, we saw the internet as the world's encyclopedia, a collection of all of human knowledge. But now with so much of it being artificial, it seems like the internet is going to start resembling real life. It's going to be a lot messier and complicated where the lines between facts and opinions blur. We'll just have to make sure we keep the benefits of advanced technology like AI 
while making sure we keep the real social bonds that humans evolved to have. So that's where I disagree with Illuminati Pirate. What he sees as death, I see as rebirth. To me, the death of the internet kind of resembles the death of our hunter-gatherer lifestyle. When ancient humans started farming, majority of us decided that our hunter-gatherer lifestyle had to die so we could reshape society with the agricultural revolution. So maybe we'll have to do something similar, except this time it's for the artificial revolution. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to see more real content like this, make sure to like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.